Hi guys! Today I want to share with you a really easy to make um, appetizer recipe with peppers and I have two delicious options to share with you. So let's get started with the recipe. The first thing you want to do is to wash the peppers well. And then you want to half them and uh, remove the seeds. And then I also have these uh, green peppers here. So here they are called uh, pimientos. I know they are also called patron peppers. Um, they have a mild spice to them, so you could use these for both or you could use these uh, for the ones with bacon and then as I did the colorful ones for um, the other stuffing. Just <laughs> decide yourself which, which ones you like and which ones you would like to use. And then obviously the same thing with these, we also want to remove the seeds from these. So now for the um, raw peppers, so the ones that are not going to be baked, I'm using a red onion and then for the ones with the bacon I'm going to use garlic and chives. I'm also going to decorate these with chives, so the colorful ones that I'm not going to bake. Um, so what you can do is you can use just the same for both. So you could make a one mix and then just uh, fill the peppers and then add uh, some uh, feta on top of the ones that are not going to be baked and then the bacon to the one that is going to be baked. Or if you want a little bit of um, variation then just do what I'm going to do now. and use different kind of onions for the different kind of peppers. And then we just want to finally dice this. So then I have my uh, natural flavored cream cheese here. I'm gonna add in the red onion. I'm also going to season with some freshly ground black pepper. Just going to give it a short mix. Also adding in half of the feta cheese to the cream cheese. What I also think would taste really great is some um, olives. So you could chop up some olives and also add them in at this point. So we're just gonna mix everything well. And so now the filling for my peppers that I'm gonna keep, keep a roll is ready and I can fill the peppers. So you just want to take some of the filling with a spoon and then just scoop it into the peppers. Just about one teaspoon each. And then for the ones with bacon, I have uh, a small band of um, chives. So just gonna finely chop this. And then I'm also gonna use a clove of garlic. So <laughs> you can see I really love garlic. This is quite big. You could use the garlic or you could also just use the chives. 
and then I have the cream cheese here again I'm gonna use a garlic press instead of mincing the garlic but you can also just mince it also adding in the chives not forgetting the freshly ground pepper and also just a little salt uh, because the bacon is quite salty so we don't need a lot of salt and then just give it a good mix so this filling is also ready and I'm gonna start filling the rest of my peppers I have a baking tray here uh, already covered with parchment paper and I'm just gonna Fill some of the cream cheese filling into the peppers and I'm just gonna place them here for now so I'm still gonna add the bacon but they can wait there so then I have all the little peppers here and what I've done is I've cut the bacon stripes into thirds and now I'm just gonna wrap the little peppers and then once all your peppers are wrapped in the bacon you want to pop them in the oven as instructed in the recipe so then uh, I have my peppers ready and plated. The ones with the bacon are a little bit smaller because the peppers were smaller as well, but they are definitely worth giving a try. They are super delicious. And now I've already started decorating these with a little bit of extra uh, red onion. And then I also want to crumble just a little bit more of the feta cheese on top and then the last thing I'm gonna add in some chives and I'm just gonna generously decorate the whole plate with some chives and then they're ready to be served So these peppers are really easy to make and uh, you can make either of these or you can make both of these. You can um, adjust the recipe a little bit to your liking. As I mentioned, I got a thought <laughs> while I was making these about an olive. So next time I'm definitely gonna add uh, olives to the raw mix. So basically to the cream cheese that goes into the peppers that are served raw because I think it's gonna be delicious so <laughs> so you can adjust these and um, make them um, as you like I think these are perfect for uh, parties for get-togethers for movie nights and for game nights so you can serve them along your other appetizers and I think they will be a good variation to um, the other kind of meat intense um, appetizers so give them a try and I hope you're gonna like these I hope you enjoyed this recipe and I hope you're going to be trying it out I'm also um, gonna share some more appetizer recipes next week with you and those will be also with two variations and also including a vegetable so stay tuned for that if you enjoyed this video don't forget the thumbs up for support and also if you are new to my channel then you can subscribe right now and if you tap the bell then you won't miss the recipe coming next week thank you for watching my video bye bye until next time